any kind of qigong or meditation involves the explicit or implicit self-control of one's qi. Just like the blood flows continuously in our arteries, veins, and numerous tiny peripheral vessels, our qi also moves continuously in our 12 meridians, eight channels, and numerous tiny luo mai and sun mai. In Waigus 1 and 2, we use circular movements and a shifting of body weight to induce the better circulation of qi in our 12 meridians. And now, in Waigus 6, we are using the effective device of patting along the meridians to unblock our 12 meridians, thus promoting our qi flow and improving our blood circulation. As you may already have known, 12 meridians can be divided into 6 in meridians and 6 yang meridians. Those connected with the in organs are called the in meridians, and those connected with the yang organs are called the yang meridians. Since all 12 meridians run through our limbs, and they are connected either with the tips of the toes or the tips of the fingers. We can also divide 12 meridians into six hand-related meridians and the six foot-related meridians. Thus, we have three hand-related in meridians. three hand-related yang meridians, three foot-related in meridians, and a three foot-related yang meridians. For best result, when we pat, we should pay attention to the order of which meridian to pat first and in what direction we are patting. Since those echo points located around the joints are usually important ones, we should pay more attention to our joints when we are patting. 